Hey guys, Merck here. Today I'm looking at the HD7970 made by ASUS. Pretty keen to test it out in some crisis and I mean you guys know I'm not the best when it comes to hardware specifications but I know when a game looks pretty, runs smooth and I know when that's because of the graphics card so let's run some demos. What you're currently watching here is some Crisis 3 footage I took earlier tonight. Now, the ATI Radeon 7970 made by ASUS, HD 7970, I suppose that's an important detail, uh, has absolutely no problems running this. Now, the rest of my rig comprises of a first generation i7, uh, a, you know, same generation motherboard, 12 gig of RAM, and, uh, and obviously the 7970 all powered by a Thermaltake uh, 1200 watt power supply which is a little bit of overkill but if I ever want to upgrade I can do so based on the fact that that power supply can power almost anything um, but yeah no it hadn't had any problems with Crisis at all it handled it absolutely fine uh, apart from the occasional uh, throttling of the FPS, which I imagine was based on my CPU speed rather than the graphics card itself. Uh, but generally it ran at around 45 to 60 FPS, depending on the scene, how many shadows. I was running it on Ultra uh, 1920 by 1080 resolution, so like highest quality and uh, it was handling it fine even with uh, the rest of my hardware being slightly older. Um, it also run, uh, runs and ran well uh, absolutely perfectly. No, no trouble, no graphical lag, 60 FPS all the time uh, with vertical sync enabled. Uh, I'm, everything I do I have vertical sync enabled because I'm using kind of an older monitor as well. But, uh, yeah, the only problem I did come across, uh, was while playing Battlefield 3, and that was a graphics error when I went on full screen that kind of made the game, uh, unplayable, which was unfortunate. Uh, drivers have always kind of been an issue for AMD. Um, I personally prefer NVIDIA. I mean, that's just me. I find their hardware to be not hardware but drivers to be slightly more reliable but once again that's just me um, otherwise the hardware is absolutely fantastic and ASUS has done a bang up job I'll have more on the hardware specifications in the next video this is Merc out